Investigations into the mismanagement of funds for the Kawempe Kafu and Kafu Kiriandongo section of the Gulu Kampala Highway Road mm -hmm. has taken a new twist after former head of procurement at the Uganda National Roads Authority, Dan Mugura, revealed incriminating evidence against his former bosses. Appearing before the Commission of Inquiry into UNRWA, Mugura denied any role in the scandalous procurements for the Kawempe Kafu Road project. The road is crumbling less than two years after it was completed. Is there any irregularity that if you had looked at these documentations, you would have pointed out? They found that submissions were made behind my back. I also discovered that my name was typed and people signed, but fortunately enough, I've been able to identify the owners of those signatures. Did you report these cases of uh, fraud? I reported to police. He incriminated members of the then five-member UNRWA Contracts yeah. Committee who he it's says it's should be investigated. Patrick Mhumza was the chairperson of the Contracts Committee. The law requires that we have a lawyer, and this was uh, by the names of Marvin Bariarha. The third one was Aguma Jeremy. Patrick Mhumza was our administration manager. According to the PPD Act, the Contracts Committee has to make decisions after conferring with the head of procurement. But Mugura says he was sidelined after raising a number of questions on the Kawempe Calf Road project. I asked, why are we doing direct procurement? Uh, we had a discussion and concluded it that way, but we did not come to an agreement. And that was the last time I was consulted. Despite UNRWA handling one of the biggest budgets in the country, Mugura told the commission that he managed the UNRWA procurement and disposal alongside one official, his junior Nora Chan, we are accused of acting behind his back. Were you ever pushed, pressurized to the wall to do something that was against your will? I can say no to you, but in various ways. And when I said no to them, that's when I left. The accounting officer, the ED, um, because at the end of the day he's responsible for a procurement. Even, he's even responsible for making sure the process is not flawed. Would you say in this case he acted properly? I did not see him taking action against staff who were usurping the powers. Mm -hmm. Dan Mugra resigned from his union job four months before his contract expired. His reason for quitting was that top union senior managers were pushing him to approve recommendations from the evaluation committee which he felt were illegal. He declined to publicly name his former bosses who were pushing him to do the unlawful. Some of the officials expected before the commission next week include Minister of Lands and Housing, Daudi Mijereko, the managing director of Enago Project that reconstructed the Kawempe Kafu and Kafu Kiriandongo Road sections, as well as former acting UNRWA executive director, Sebo Gachimeze, who has been charged in the anti-corruption court. Criminal summons have been issued against former UNRWA Director of Legal Affairs, Marvin Badiarwa, who earlier this week turned himself over to the Anti-Corruption Court. Sudil Biarhanga, NTV.